the world's biggest glove maker, has its hands full. Thousands of workers at Top Glove in Malaysia have tested positive for COVID-19. The government has put 60% of its factories and some of its dormitories under lockdown. Coronavirus cases have been rising at Top Glove factories in Malaysia. After carrying out assessments, We've advised the closure of 28 top club factories. They'll be shut in phases and workers will be screened. 60% of the world's glove supply comes from Malaysia. It's cornered the market due to its vast rubber plantations and government support for the industry, which generates billions of dollars in sales each year. While many sectors have struggled during the pandemic, the rubber industry has thrived. According to the Malaysian Rubber Glove Manufacturers Association, demand has jumped by at least 30 percent this year due to COVID-19. It forecasts Malaysian companies will sell 220 billion items this year, up from 170 billion last year. They're expected to make $5.2 billion in revenue from glove exports. The price of gloves has um, increased at least four times, at least fourfold compared to pre-COVID era. Um, some say that, uh, uh, well, of course, some many, many people say that it is the manufacturers who are, you know, uh, making a large profit out of this pandemic. But of course, it is also because um, of the spike in global demand and the supply uh, just cannot cope with it. And therefore, you know, it's just basic economics. Top Glove makes one in every four gloves worldwide. The Malaysian company recorded its best ever profit for the quarter ending in September, raking in $315 million. That's a 1,600 percent increase compared to the same period last year. But analysts say its profits and supplies could be impacted by the very same outbreak that's been helping its business. This kind of lockdown within the factories and also quarantine of the workers will actually halt the operation to a certain extent. Although I do not see that the global production is going to be very much affected, but what is going to be affected for sure is their order and their delivery schedule is going to be delayed. And now, Top Glove faces the task of screening thousands of workers to bring Malaysia's largest active COVID cluster under control. Natasha Hussein, TRT World.